Hi there. Well, a couple of people have requested I post an update video about my experience at a Ron Fellows C8 Corvette Owners Performance Driving School. Well, I'm working on it, but there's so much that I want to say that it's taking me longer than I expected. So I decided to post this little teaser video for you. First, I want to say that this is one of the highlight experiences of my life, and I've had a lot of them. And by far, the most fun I've ever had behind the wheel of a car. Even if you have no plans of ever tracking your car or not even interested in the performance aspects of the Corvette, this is a great opportunity to experience all that goes along with that and in someone else's car and in a controlled environment. And if you are looking to track or race your C8, there is so much to be learned here. With the new car discount provided by GM, this becomes the number one lifestyle experience value on the planet. Go. Just go. In the videos, of other people's experience, sometimes it's difficult to discern just how fast we are allowed to drive and how close to the edge the instructors will let us get. Well, I'm here to tell you that you'll be able to drive as fast and as close to the edge as your balls will allow. Here's an example where you will see my new friend Doug as he gets right up to that edge and a little over as his rear end kicks out as he crests the little rise to turn four, yep, in turn four, there's a big hump as you hit that at over 70 miles an hour. It is one thing to kick the rear end out around a corner on the streets at 25 miles an hour or so and something else altogether different to do it on a race course at 70 miles per hour plus. And this was during a wind-up lap. In subsequent laps, we would go through this corner 10 miles an hour quicker. This was viewed through the windshield of my car as I followed him. Check it out. We're going in that wheel straight. Take your time here to set your hands down the drop. That way we can stay on throttle as we go through. On here through four, just trying to get to the curb behind that first apex go. Well, that was an exciting moment, huh? My comprehensive overview of the two days will be up soon. Bottom line is, you have to go do this. All right, that's good, Steve. But well, we kind of hold the steering out of the apex there. So that's how that back end came around just a little bit there. So make sure we're opening up that wheel out of the apex. All right, bring it to the inside. Give us well straight away. Looking right here. Let's look through the corner, look through that middle lane. That's where we want the car to end up.